Every Sunday, amidst the high-end stores, a strange thing happens. The center of Hong Kong is transformed. Thousands of Filipinas and Indonesians, almost all of them domestic workers, gather on every patch of shade. Sidewalks, subways, and underpasses. This is their one day off, and they're determined to enjoy themselves. They rent used cardboard boxes from local sellers to sit on. And for a bit of privacy, then settle in to play cards, eat, laugh, and socialize. Or just catch up on sleep after a long, hard week. There are over 300,000 domestic workers in Hong Kong. One in three Hong Kong households with children has a maid. Some have been here for over 20 years. Others are just getting settled. It's a close-knit sorority, and newcomers quickly find shared interests and make friends. But there's more to this than just a social outing. It turns out that Filipinas are excellent businesswomen. In fact, most of these gatherings are mobile, undercover restaurants serving Filipina favorites. That's a menu. So's that. It's the best and cheapest meal you can find in Hong Kong. The problem is, foreign workers are not legally allowed to make money on the side. And the Hong Kong government has created a special police force to make sure not a penny changes hands. Luckily, the police can't do anything unless they see a cash transaction, and the women have gotten very good at sleight of hand. The average nanny earns a little over $500 a month and sends almost every penny home to support her own family, particularly her parents, and school fees for her children though they do occasionally indulge in a few luxuries. Shoes, manicures and pedicures, and some makeup. Who doesn't want to look good now and then? For those who are not into material possessions, there's plenty of spiritual comfort. There's even a Christian healer who will draw out your sins and get rid of them for you. Others volunteer to keep an eye on their blood pressure and make sure they're not too stressed. they've managed to take a difficult situation in a foreign land and make it their home. 